woman is warning others to be wary of potential housing scams, all after it happened to her. A Maryland woman says she fell victim to a scammer she believes is based in Fargo. Shauna Bruno discovered the scam after she signed a lease and paid a $2,000 security deposit. Police say there isn't much they can do to get her money back. The Better Business Bureau says it's also best to talk to the landlord face-to-face -face and see the property for yourself before signing anything. I think scammers realize it's a pretty good way to make some money, unfortunately, and uh, so they always put these ads out there, and, and sometimes people run into them and have a bad experience. The BBB says if you're only contacting the person through phone calls or emails, it's probably a scam. You should also look for improper grammar and advertisements. That could also be a sign of a scam.